Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Urban Carla and in today's video we are going to be talking about long hair and how you can grow it out fast like me. A lot of you always ask me, you know, how I have really long hair, how I grew so fast and what products I used. So today I'm going to be talking about all my tricks and um, I'm going to be reviewing a product that OGX sent me. I feel like it's super perfect that they sent me these new products because i was going to talk about this brand anyways because they are the reason why my hair grew out super fast so i'm just going to be straightforward with you guys because i feel like when i watch a beauty or like makeup um related videos they never get to the point they always take too long to just tell you what it is i'm just i'm just here to let you guys know what's up so first things first do not burn your hair. I am one, I never straighten my hair, I never curl my hair. I know a lot of you, you know, you every type of person, like we all have different hair, so I understand, you know, if you like your hair better straight or you know it's better like when you curl it or make it into waves because your hair is not, you know, perfectly like wavy or straight. But it's really good to not burn your hair a lot just because I notice girls that are always constantly um burning their hair like straightening it and stuff they have a lot of split ends now if you do do that and you have you know split ends it does help to um put oil in your hair you know when you get out the shower and before you um burn your hair so when i do go out to um, festivals or concerts i do burn my hair i do curl it but that's honestly the only time now me because i have long hair and i take like an hour or two to do my makeup i don't have time to do my hair when i go out i don't feel like you know doing all that extra stuff just to like you know go out with friends and stuff so what i like to do is when i shower i like to braid my hair and then as i'm doing my makeup um i just let it you know get wavy and stuff and then I feel like in the other clip that I'm going to show you guys, you will see what I do. So before I take off my braids, I like to hairspray it. And then I just like to go like this. I take off my braids and then I put more hairspray or mousse. And that's what I like to do because it gives me that curly or like wavy effect. Hello guys. So I wanted to show you really quick how my hair looks before I cut it. I'm going to cut it next week, so I just wanted to film really quick. So what I do, because I don't like to burn my hair, um, I braid it. It looks like a mess right now because I was sleeping. But I like to braid it um, when it's wet, I take night showers. And then the next day, um, I just grab my hairspray and I just like spray it so it can stay wavy. You can also use like mousse when you like take out the braids too. But I like to do this. I like to let it sit. And then now I'm just going to take my braid off. And yeah, I like to do this when I want to like style my hair. But I'm like, you know, running late. I don't have time to curl it. So this is perfect to do it because it comes out super cute. So yeah, I wanted to do this video for you guys to show you guys all my tricks on what I do with my hair. And yeah, I am planning on cutting it, but um, I'm going to just cut the ends. I like to just cut the ends like in a V. And yeah, I had a dream last night that I went to the salon and they freaking chopped off my hair up to here. And they literally just did one piece, and I was so mad that I walked out of the salon, and I didn't even pay. I feel like I'm just scared to cut my hair. But yeah, so, I just go like this. Oh, shit. This is like the style I always do. So yeah, I just want to show you guys really quick. I'm wearing my sweatpants, so don't judge me. So this is how long my hair is right now. When it's, you know, straight, it goes up to my butt. 
but that's how long it is and yeah so basically it's already june like the middle of june i the last time i cut my hair was lit in like last may like literally a year ago and this is how much it's grown i don't know if you can see the difference between you know my dyed hair and my roots but that's how much it's grown and yeah i'm just going to cut the ends because like my hair's been really dry lately but um putting oil in it has helped but yeah so that's what i do instead of um burning my hair me personally like i have um wavy hair so when i straighten my hair like it just doesn't get straight like some girls like i don't know how they do it but like it gets like super super straight and i'm just like me like it's just straight like this and then it gets like wavy and i feel like i just have to like blow dry it or something but that's why i don't really straighten my hair a lot but yeah those are like that's what i do when i style my hair super easy and super fast all right so another trick of mine is braiding your hair or putting it into a bun when you sleep so i do not do that anymore because as you can see my hair is already how i want it i don't want it any more longer but what i used to do is i used to put it up in a bun and or you could french braid because basically you are um pulling your roots out so you're like pulling it because girl your hair is growing from up here so like basically you're just like pulling it and that helps um just make it grow faster personally that's how it helped me as you can see but yeah that's one of the tricks another trick is girl don't cut your hair don't cut your hair what I do is I literally cut only my ends, not up to here, not up to here. I only cut my ends every two, like twice a year or maybe just once a year. That's what I do. My hair is still a little dead because I used to bleach it before and I like dyed it red and everything. If your hair is really dead, it's good to cut it every couple, like five, six months, but just cut the ends. I have a lot of people that I know, a lot of friends, that they're going through something or they want to change in their life and they want to cut their whole hair off. They're like, oh my gosh, like my hair's going to be super cute, I'm going to cut it, blah, blah. And then after a couple, two months, they're over the hairstyle. They want their, there's literally all my friends that I know that have cut their hair, have experienced this. Don't cut your hair. Like it's good to like do it like once in a while. If you do like your ends, but if you're gonna cut your whole hair off, like. I feel like you're probably gonna regret it because you're gonna miss your old hair. That's my personal opinion. Comment down below what your thoughts are, but that is my opinion on when people cut their hair. I feel like everyone always regrets it because you know you it's gonna take a while to like let it grow out again. So and like if you wanna change like maybe like dye it but like just chopping it all off like you're gonna miss your hair girl just letting you know that so i wanted to show you guys really quick how my hair looks i know i did a clip um for you guys where i show you guys the before i cut my hair so you see how it's not that you know big of a difference but i just cut my ends when my hair is straight or wet Basically, my hair was up to my butt, like up to my butt crack, and now it's a lot shorter. I don't like to cut my hair um, in layers because it does look shorter when I do, but when I do cut it into a V, it does create a little bit of layers. So I just want to show you guys how that looks. My hair is not done yet, so that's why it looks poofy. But yeah, these are very, very simple tricks that you guys could do you know put your hair up pull on them roots 
don't burn your hair so much take care of your hair you know put some oil on it and um don't cut your hair so much don't chop it all off those are super duper simple tips that i could share with you guys you guys could do them and your hair could grow in a matter of one or two years so now we are gonna go into the biggest reason why my hair is super long and it grew out super fast All right guys, so my secret to long hair is biotin. Biotin has helped me reach my dreams of having long hair. This is the first time in my life that I have long hair in high school, middle school, elementary school. Like I never had long hair and I always wanted it. But me, I just wanted to bleach it, I wanted to dye it red. So this is the first time that I do have it long. So um, it took me like two years to grow it out. I did all the stuff that I just told you guys. And the biggest thing that helped me was OGX Biotin and Collagen Shampoo and Conditioner that i used every day i restocked when i ran out and tell me why that is the only shampoo and conditioner that actually made my hair soft because i had really damaged hair that brand like saved my life and the smell of it i love the smell of it it's super sweet now you're asking why don't where is the stuff at where is the shampoo at I don't have it with me because I am done growing my hair out. I don't want to grow out my hair out anymore. Like, I'm done with it. Like, it's way too long now. You know, I recently cut it. I don't want to chop it a lot because I'm scared I might regret it. But I'm done using it. I don't have it anymore. I will um, insert a picture or I will link it down below. But that is my secret to growing my hair out fast. Now you can also buy biotin, you know, at Target or, you know, your pharmacy. Um, biotin basically is a vitamin that helps you grow out your nails and your hair. And I guess, you know, OGX made that shampoo and conditioner. And they also have like an oil for it, but I never tried it out. So they um, put biotin in it. And it's probably like the best shampoo and conditioner I have ever bought. I have heard that um, horse shampoo and like other shampoos like help you grow out your hair. But me personally, this shampoo and conditioner have helped me out so much. So I'm really, really excited because the brand OGX collab with Influencer and they sent me these, um, their new collection. So I'm going to be reviewing um, this today with you guys. So they came out with their new collection. It's called Liquid Pearl. And it's basically um, like a mermaid type of um, shampoo and conditioner. It's a mermaid theme. And basically um, it has pearl, um, what's it called? pearl extract and sea kelp. And um, that helps your ends to be more shiny and more silky so i freaking love this collection i love it so much because number one the smell of it like i like scented stuff i love you know like flowery scented stuff and the serum and the shampoo and conditioner have that scent and not only that but I love their packaging. Like, I love girly things. So, their packaging, it looks like this. I don't know if you could see it, but it's like an iridescent type of um, packaging. This one, the actual serum has like little glitters on it. So, like, when you put it on your hand, you know, you could see it. But the shampoo and the conditioner, it's not like that. Only the packaging looks like that 
So this is how the conditioner looks. And this one, like, um, the inside, it's, like, um, just, like, a pink cream look. And this one is, um, yeah, it's, like, a purpley clear look. But this is how the packaging looks. It's so cute. I'm, like, in love with this collection because I already love their, um, products so much. So the fact that, um, they came out, like, with the mermaid theme, it was super cute. Again, if you are one that likes scented stuff, this product is for you because I just love the smell of it. Um, I tried it on yesterday and after the shower, like, my hair smelled so good. And I put the serum on after. I'm really bummed because this is the first time Influencer sent me something that's broken. So, like, this um, has a top on it, like a little pump but it broke when it got here so what i have to do is like i just have to open it like this and put it on i don't feel like returning it because i think you're able to return it if it's broken i just don't feel like doing all of that so i'm just gonna use it like that so i just want to show you let me see you can see like the iridescence but that's how it looks and i'm just gonna put it on my hair for you guys really quick because um my hair is really, really poofy, so the pearl extract is going to help um, my ends be more silky. And girl, like, just go to Target or something and open the bottle and smell this because it freaking smells so good. Let me see if I can see it. It's so pretty too. Like, I love girly things. And I love things that smell good. You see how, like, my hair is already, like, not poofy? And it's, like, manageable. Like, I don't like when my hair just looks so crazy. So, yeah. I give this product an A. A 10 out of 10 because... I love it so much and I'm really, I'm super happy they sent me this because, you know, I'm not using their biotin anymore. So I will be using this now to have my hair smell super good and so it could stay silky. Alright guys, that is it for today's video. These tips and tricks are super easy to follow. Please let me know your thoughts down below. I will be linking the products down below also. Please subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. Love you guys.